Hello guys, welcome back to our video and today in everyday life you see um, you might have made these things at one point. Um I don't know what they're called, but it's like a chain thing. Uh, please guys, literally tell me tell me what it's called. <laughs> Anyways, let's get started. So, um, these two things are pretty similar, if you don't know, but, um, we are now here to test them all about, um, and see which one of them are better and would recommend in your very own contraptions. So, let's do this. Ding, 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 ding. The first obvious thing we might try to first do is speed. So, what are we gonna do? Is we're just gonna max out their speed and see how fast these things can get. Oh boy, the rope one already goes crazy. Well, the, the chain one has a little bit more gentle approach, but then starts to go in the same chaotic way. Now, you see, um, you might notice I'm using gears. Oh, whoa. Has now retracted and it's all right. Uh, it one of the 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 rope one has fallen loose and it's doing interesting things actually. It's like some kind of very unique yo-yo move. Okay, I don't know, but certainly it proves to be really interesting. But this is just nothing but chaos. The next thing we need to see is her. Uh, how fast they can go without going, you know, chaotic. So, um, um, at this rate, the, um, both of them are going crazy, but if I put a, oh, wow. Well, it doesn't go as planned. Well, what's the next one, I think? Uh, could it be uh, its effectiveness at carrying stuff? Well, let's see. Uh, let's start at, you know what, 45. And now, we're going to position them. Send gears and center and center. Can you go center, please? Please, go center. Uh, it's not going centering. It doesn't want the center. So, we'll just... We'll just make... We'll just add things at the top. And we'll now begin. So, first of all, let's drop an object. On the same size, exactly on top. And let's see who will get to the finish first. And now, relax. The rope wins, even though there's some inaccuracies. I know, I know, I know, I know. But now, um, who will be the best at destroying stuff? Actually, before we get to that, let's see which one makes the. I don't want to. Let's see which one will make the best tank crack. First, before we do that, we gotta realign. May got realign. All right. So I think what we will do is we make this long, and then what we do is just we just simply. Just have two of these, and then we will attach the gears. So we will just make a tank, okay, and do a race. Um, you know what? Let's do collision layer. And here we go! Oh, the tanks are in here. Oh, looks like the chain is... Looks like has, it's gonna be faster than the ropes. The ropes are going at 4.2 meters. Okay, I don't know. I need to slow them. 
go by 4.4. They're currently trying to overcome and overtake each other. But I'm afraid that won't happen. Let's go B. Let's make this one B. Let's see. Wow, looks like Chain is overtaking even at same speeds. Um, you see the two axles are both at 45, but for some reason the chain, the chain tr tank track is faster. Um, oh, um, oh, oh, I thought it just, they just equalized in speed, but no, the, the chain one is, has, is overtaking the rope, and yeah, there we go, chain. Chain will win the battle. Alright, let's go. Oh, why is it slow? Oh, never mind. No, no. Alright, so the rope has won, like, I don't know, once? Okay, I don't know so far. I think Chain has won two times, but the rope only once. Actually, rope won two times, but Chain only once. I think... Um, but now, maybe they have tied, and, and we will, uh, do the ultimate showdown. Oh, no, that's not the, okay. this. So now they have a middle gear, that will keep them stable. Which one will, uh, yeah! Um, boom, boom. there we go. Alright, let's set this one at a higher rate and see if it can beat the row one. Oh no, it broke. No, bro, and Chain will continue to win. <laughs> well, that's a. Oh, Ro one wants to catch up, but apparently cannot. He cannot. You know what? Uh, uh, you 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 remember this where the rope just does weird things? The gear just like it's like some kind of extreme uh, yo-yo. I don't know. You know, let's, let's see if the gear can do the same. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. They're both equally cool. Since but since the chain is heavier, it doesn't make much of a uh, good ones as the rope does. Like um, a very lots of complicated stuff happening here, but um yeah yeah I guess the rope won again, so the rope is in the lead. And now time for design. Oh whoa oh. Wow! Anyways, time for the design. Um, let's compare them. Let's compare them. But first, we have to hang them. Have to hang them. Hang them. Hang them. Okay. All right. So um. So um, it appears in in extra rope wins out but um, the chain it has like different shapes and design and i kind of like that but the uh, but the design like this is just kind of boring but this one might be slightly better you see hmm. yeah i guess that's where um they just you know, a tight they just have the same sort of rope might still be in the lead. But remember what happened to the ropes when I just spin them really fast? Well, that gives me an idea. They could it. All right, so um, the two chains are gathering up speed. If you know, the, okay, they had the same collision. One will be A, one will be B. There we go. Now, let's start spinning them into extraordinary speed. 
Right. Let me make them a little bit more frictionized. Mm. Oh, the, for some reason the chain is now the first to reach full scale. Okay, let's change it into six and seven. We'll disable aerodynamic friction because, you know, obviously. Go. In three, two, one. No. <laughs> oh, that's not the... Are you kidding me? Three, two, one. Oh, um, well, the chain just died up, and now the rope just does that the extraordinary thing. Look at that! It's like futuristic wheels using centrifugal force. Look at this. The rope is continuing and continuing. Is it just, maybe just because purely the, ro the chain is the bad start? Well, let's find out. Mm. Oh, the rope is getting more spaced out. Let's hope the rope does uh, accidentally exit. Look at the rope. The rope is like spaced out. Oh no, it's coming out of control. Oh, calm down. Will you go back to your place? Shoo. Where's the chain? I can't see the chain. Let's make the chain white. Red. Red is easier to see. Let's see how the chain does. Whoa! Oh, this time the chain does one. Huh. I don't know why. Let's, let's give a redo for the rope. All right. Hold up. I know. I know. I have an idea. Let's freeze all the chain and just let them start up. Three, two, one. Go. Let's make the chain red again so we can see it. The rope has a good start. Oh, no. Chain just died out that at the end, but the rope just continues. Why can't I have them both race at the same time? This doesn't make any sense, man. Oh, that's the last one. Let's make them both A and B, actually. I can realize I just can make them. Are you kidding? Just hit the wall and die. All right. All right, let's do this. Mm. Oh, they're both co almost competing, but then in the end, the rope won. So I guess the rope won the uh, the the centrifugal match. Uh, I mean, like the if they're like forming a wheel shape and then they just go and race. So I guess that's the end of this video. The rope. Is one the rope one uh, the competition? So I suggest for all of you guys who build who build, I suggest you should use a rope. And yeah, I would like to see you guys next time. And, and bye. Oh no, for goodness' sake.